So hello there, this is going to be yet another mechanic video and it's going to demo appearance settings and some new stuff in launcher. So basically let's kick let's kick things off with appearance. So what you basically have here is those two panes, panels or whatever you wanna call them, that basically contain the GTK team, team and the window decoration team. So as you can see now we have the match checkbox on by default and displaying incomplete teams off by default now those those are going to be changeable in the next version but for, for the time being that's not the case because the implementation is not really complete so basically watch what happens if i change the turn the team to let's say evolve dark as you can see it changed it changes the team to evolve dark and it also changes the window decoration team to evolve dark basically that's because match team is ticked on by default so you don't get um, ambient gtk team with advaita window decoration and some other wibbly wobbly stuff icon team is basically pretty st straightforward you get a list of icon team here and you can choose so unity icon team or find the ambience now just let it load just Yep, that's bucking. No, it's not bucking mechanics, it's probably bucking G settings or stuff like this. You have to click on that icon to refresh. refresh. And you have also the plus and minus install and remove icon teams, but those don't work yet. So now just let me go back to my icon team. No, it's the other one. Yep. And cursor team is basically pretty straightforward. You have the same user experiences in icon team. You just click on cursor team you want, for example, white glass, and it's going to change to white glass. Now that doesn't quite work because it requires a bit of time to refresh. So I have to wait for a few minutes for the icon for the cursor team change to kick off. It's not bucking mechanic. It's again bucking G settings or stuff like this and last but not least i'm going to talk about the launcher so we have urgent animation that's basically when an application requires attention it can go wiggling or it can go pulsing now i'm not going to demonstrate that because i really have no idea how to invoke that except open a truck out of windows and that's going to be really stupid of me to do so i'm going to demo the launch animation basically it can go pulse or blink or no animation at all now let's see it to no animation Let's open something. As you can see, there is no animation here and now that loaded. So if I set it to blink, I click here, it went blinking and that open. And if I set it to pulse, now just let it pulses, pulses and it loads. So that's pretty much it and see you in the next video.